In this tutorial, I will show you how to create a 3D parametric function plot. I'll also show you how to save the function as a theme file so you can reuse it. You can also download a function as a theme file from the Origin Lab website. We begin by creating a seashell surface in Origin using the parameterization equations we get from Wikipedia. We're going to copy these, put them in a notepad window, simplifying the equations and making them ready to use in Origin. We now open Origin and click the File menu choosing New, Function Plot, 3D Parametric Function Plot. In the dialog that opens, I'm going to copy the equations from the notepad window. We copy X and paste that in. These are all in terms of U and V. Repeat for Y and Z. You can include predefined variables. We're going to do that as well. You just double click here in the name box and you can type in the name of your variable, which will add a new variable. We'll call it A. Now we enter the value. And we repeat those steps, enter a new variable called B and its value. Let's change the parameter scale and the mesh grid. We're going to save this function now so that we can use it later without having to input all this information again. Save as, enter in a theme name. Click OK. The theme is now called Seashell. When we click OK, we're actually going to create the plot. You can click the button on the toolbar there on the left, or just simply use the keyboard shortcut, the R key, to rotate the plot. So just click and drag to rotate. You can customize the plot with the Plot Details dialog. Like any origin graph, just double click on the plot. If we wish to make use of that theme file, I would click on File New again, choose Function Plot, 3D Parametric Function Plot, in the dialog that opens next to the theme, I click that flyout, and you'll see at the bottom that I have my seashell. It loads in all the settings there, the equation. If a graph window is active when you open the dialog, the drop down is going to be enabled. You can choose to either create a new graph or to add to an existing graph. We're going to create a new one. We could have added it to that other graph if we wanted. We're going to show you here where the theme file is saved. It's actually saved under your user files folder. You could send that file to a colleague and then they would have access to that function. If you go to the Origin Lab website, you can view and download a number of these theme files for many different 3D parametric function plots. We scroll through the list here, click on the Klein bottle, download the function. Again, it's just going to save a theme file like the one that we saved. 
It's going to download that file and save it in the same location as the one that we created. We go back to Origin. That theme will be available to us if I simply click on the file menu. So we're going to go ahead and create the Klein bottle plot. And to do that, I simply click on File, New, Function Plot, 3D Parametric Function Plot. In the dialog that opens from the theme flyout, we'll see Klein bottle. It loads in the equations. This particular one has some before formula lab talk script. This gets used above in the equations. Click OK. We get our graph. Again, we can rotate and stretch the plot. Click and you get the toolbar button, the 3D toolbar that lets you rotate. Click on those controls there to resize in any one of the direct XYZ axis directions. This concludes this tutorial. Thank you for watching.